this video. I love people that leave, I, I mean, I love you if you don't, but I really appreciate it. What I'm trying to say is, I love you even if you don't, you just watch and you give me that watch time, I appreciate you, because I know you could be watching other videos, but I love it when people leave long comments, like she took, like it means this video touched her and she left a long comment. Do you know how much effort it takes to leave a comment? I'm, I'm not even good at commenting on videos, but when someone comments on my video, I'm, I'm so, I'm just so grateful. Thank you. So this video is for uh, Sonia. Her name is Sonia. She commented, love the video. Even if it's a year old, I'm five foot two and found a woman size six Burberry trench in beige last Friday from a thrift store in Japan. Thrift shops in Japan? Girl, you're living life. What, what do you do? What do you, like, what are you doing in Japan? But anyway, um, thrift shop in Japan, it is authentic and only cost me 107 US dollars. I'm jealous. That's cheaper than mine. Like that, that's so cool. That's so good. I would love to see a picture. So I don't know if you're on socials, like message me. I want to see what it looks like. Um, I can't remember the yen price. I put it, um, I put in the dry cleaners on Saturday and we'll be wearing the insert individually as well. Uh, do you have any updates on styling, etc., with the trench? So this is what this video is. This is for you and hopefully it will help other people too. I uh, promise I'll do a video. So here it is. Um, firstly, I need to see yours because yeah, I want to see yours. That would be so cool. And, um, okay. So. If you've, if you haven't seen my other trench coat, my other video about the Berber trench coat, go and check it out. There's a whole story behind it. Basically market. I found mine on Facebook marketplace and the yard. It was a whole process. It was a whole story. And I love purchases like that, that have a bit of story behind them. And that's why I love secondhand. Actually. I think it's just so cool. Like the other time I sold my sofa on eBay, uh, cause I was redoing my house and the people that bid and won, they were doing the great British interior design on BBC one show, which is airing next year. And my sofa right now is in a hotel lobby in Glasgow. And I know not everyone's like buyers and sellers will have that story, but the world of secondhand is a world indeed. It's so exciting. It's such a good community and I just love it. Anyway, I got my trench coat secondhand and I'm five foot two, like Sonia said. So it's interesting because it just gives you a reference if you're also petite and to just know how to style and to be confident regardless of your height and regardless of the size and regardless of the style. If you've fallen in love with it and you believe you can handle it in your wardrobe, like you should get it. There's such classics and they're such good quality with this trench coat it actually comes as two in one so which is what Sonia was saying that um you can wear the trench coat as a jacket so it will have the insert removed or you can wear it as a coat which will have the insert you know zipped back on and so the benefit is obviously like for colder weathers then you put on the insert for not so cold weathers but you need to have something on you just remove the insert because the insert is like another thick layer of wool um, to keep you warm uh, but the benefit of that is always, I love a two in one situation or even a three in one. Sometimes you get that. Um, you can also use the insert by itself cause it's such a nice like played, uh, pattern. It's so pretty. It's such a classic, um, print or pattern rather. So yeah, this video is to talk through how I've been enjoying my jacket and my, my jacket slash coat because it isn't, I grab for it so many times. Like it's just become a staple is just becoming every day. Like I grab for it so many times cause it's so easy. It makes anything you're wearing look fine and good. And even just, 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 just classic. I feel like a, a blogger when I'm wearing that coat, it's so heavy as well. And so dramatic. Like, I don't know. Anyway. Um, okay. So number one, let's try and structure this video. A trench coat for me is a trench coat, trench jacket. It, this is both because you get two because of the insert that comes off. Um, the insert wearing it alone is for ambiguous weathers or, um, if you know, you're just, it's not that cold. I do think that I'm going to dedicate this video to hardcore winter because we are now going there. 
and i think with any outfit for hardcore winter especially with a trench coat because the trench coat is not exactly fitted mine is a men's one and it's quite it's quite on the large side so it has a lot of room it's, ha it's a ha it has a lot of gaps which is a great thing because i can layer i don't have to worry about feeling nauseous because i'm like sucked in like i don't have to worry about that but it does mean it allows a lot of air through sometimes so you do need to kind of have a backup and for me that backup is wearing um thermos so i have four um i have i have two thermos there is set bottom and the top so four so top and a bottom a top and a bottom in two in two colors i got them from costco i'm looking i'm in the market for other um in uh thermos because i want to use thermos as pajamas in the house so that i don't use so much heating life is tough or anyway so these are all schemes i'm thinking to help me reduce my electricity bill anyway let me let me calm down um so i want to get another thermo but basically what i'm trying to say is with this trench coat for me when i'm going out i like to look cute this is the coat i grab when i want to maintain cuteness in the outfit so we want to suffer because of fashion but then we remember we cannot suffer so we grab a thermo and we put it in and then we grab the cute outfit and then we put it on and then we grab our trench coat and we put that on but we still look cute and it's not taking it's like the thing with the trench coat is it's its own thing you can never take away from it you can never add too much it's got the plate going on it's got the shoulder detail it's got the collar detail it's got the uh, flap at the back it's got the slit at the back it's got the print the pattern inside it has a lot going on you don't need to even try to to you don't need to try to do anything with it it's got its own thing going on you just do you and you just put it on top that's the kind of coat that it is and so because of that i take advantage of that and kind of like i don't i it's the kind of coat I grab when I have a whole outfit figured out, but I didn't think about what I'm going to wear on top because it just, it's going to work eight out of 10. It's going to work. But because of this, like I say, the size you need, you need, you need, you need thermos. If you don't have thermos, look around and just get you thermos. You can get them in so many places. Let me know if you want to do a deep dive or, and be specific what you want to do, what you want me to deep dive on when it comes to thermos, because I feel like it's like, thermos or thermos right but anyway mine i reach for when i am going out out but i will always pair it with a thermo because if it's cold those gaps the slits the bigness just the it's it's gonna be an issue right and then number two casual wear um the coat looks so good with just regular leggings and like i said it looks so good because it's just two tones of color or two types you can have because it's a solid color you can have a printed outfit inside and it be the stabilizing thing because the predominant color is beige and beige just kind of just neatens and calms things down so it works so well with sets it works really well with printed or patterned outfits um preferably if you can maximum have three colors or three dimensions going on with the outfit one of which being the jacket it will work it will look so classic it works really well with all black outfits because again it gives you that military vibe it gives you that really masculine on duty on the job on the go vibe it's so good it's so nice um and so that's kind of how i've been enjoying mine you can wear this with dresses as well particularly knitwear it works so well again it's a heavy duty coat so when you put on another heavy duty material it's a good contrast because especially with the cable knitwear that looks really nice because it's like a little 3d effect coming through and so it just creates layers of interest and pattern and and detail because again it the trench coat doesn't have any texture or any 3dness as such so when you add that in through an outfit that you're wearing underneath and that's just peeking through here and there it's really nice i like to pull the belt back and cinch the waist that way and ensure really what's going on inside i really like 
wear it wrapped completely and you can't see what's inside unless I'm wearing something that I shouldn't be but I'm outside and I need it to be like do you know you know you know what I you know yeah it happens sometimes I do that I literally yeah and anyway, I'm not gonna expose myself on YouTube but um sometimes it, you just you just grab and go and it, it can it can serve it can work where was I leggings and just sets and casual wear dresses knitwear is possible too if you cannot find the Berber retention because sometimes they're quite hard to find um because and also there's a lot of fakes out there i just want to make it clear that it doesn't have to be a burberry trench coat it can be a trench coat that you have fallen in love with and you and whilst it's amazing it's great to buy second hand like don't beat yourself up if you cannot find a great second hand one just pick one that isn't second hand but make sure you have plans on how it's going to last and stay in your wardrobe and how you're going to enjoy it and how's it going to work with your existing wardrobe and get a color that is uh, an easy color for you they come of course in all sorts of colors beige is, is just a classic color there is navy there is like a green emerald green there is black um do you know i've never seen a printed um or pattern a print no a printed trench coat i don't think i would get it though I think that would be a bit too loud and defeating the purpose i think for me but let me know what you like would you do you have how does it how does it work for you this video was not too structured it was literally a chat about how i how i approach my jacket but i hope you've taken nuggets of information from there and i hope the try-ons as well me showcasing what i do and how i look in the coat um has been helpful for you i think all i can say is that it's a great coat and if you're thinking about getting it do as long as it's not like an excessive purchase and you already have one and you're trying to get one in a different color like i don't know i can't can't be an ambassador of that but listen do you um if you don't have a trench coat and you're looking you're in the market um be patient keep an eye out online on places where you can buy second hand if you don't want to buy second hand have a look around there's plenty around right now just because they're very popular in autumn like transitional weather autumn winter times they're very very popular and uh yeah comment below if this has been helpful if i've missed out anything if this has not been helpful let me know um and i'll do my best to touch on whatever i may have missed but overall enjoy your coat if you already have it and sonia thank you so much for commenting and inspiring this video and i really do want to see yours i want to see yours and next time you're going to japan take us like um, I, I, I wasn't, I wasn't, I wasn't even busy. Like I was here and I was waiting for your call, but I want to go to next time you're going to Japan, you know, hook me up. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm out. I'm rambling. Have a good day. Stay safe and bye.